everybody, Jaws Jr. here for another Jaws Jr. adventure. Today, wet, gloomy day. We are sitting here in the rain. Well, I'm standing out here in the rain right now. In front of the world headquarters of Jaws Jr. Entertainment. Starting of the new chapter of the things that I'm going to be doing and I'm going to share with you. So let me show you what today's project is. And it may go beyond today because of other time constraint issues where I have commitments to do other things. We'll see. So, scrap lumber, found screws, a recycled radial arm saw stand, and hardy plank type siding. What will I be doing? Now, I'll just tell you here. I'm trying to have a zero cost out of my pocket because everything is already is either is from scrap materials. A lot of this is from the construction of the shop or the loft. So money's already been spent. It's already been used. So I don't have to spend any extra money. And I need to make myself a temporary work table until I can get the proper table I am waiting on from the Jaws Senior. So I'll show you along as I uh, make progress. I'll stop and show you what progress is being made and we'll see how well this contraption that I'm trying to do on a very tight budget of absolutely nothing. I don't want to have to run to the store for anything. How well this comes out. Talk to you later. Well, we are still continuing on with this dreary, rainy day. But being inside, we don't have to. So, made a little bit of an improvement. Had some extra spray paint around here. And so I thought I'd go ahead and hit that lick. It doesn't look too bad. I've got a couple other touch-up spots to do. But that's the gist of it. Just out of scrap lumber. And now I'm going to put the top on it and do a little bit more to it but yeah looks pretty good and i did leave the original wheels on it so i can move it around which is the whole purpose of this one and again this one is temporary this is just to hold me over for the short term But that short term could be anywhere from six months to five years. So who knows? So now I'm going to go finish it. And I will show you the final product. But again, I just wanted to stress that out of basically scrap material, I am making a pretty good small work table. Well, everybody, it's a couple of days later. I had to go do a couple unexpected things. I had to go make a trip to the north central portion of the state to go see a good friend of mine who's not doing very well. Uh, Studios of Spike. I'm praying for you, man. And same with your entire family. So, with that being done, I uh, had to get back here and finish this table made out of scrap and there you go again the stand is out of the radial arm saw and all the lumber is stuff that was left over from the construction of the shop or the construction of the loft and the screws were ones that were found in a recycle center so yeah Turned out pretty good. Now this is probably the best it's gonna look because see, it's gonna be used a lot. So one of the other future projects I'm gonna do is get this old vise cleaned up and mounted on here. Now this 
vice of all things, has some history with me. This is the one that Jaws Sr. had in his shop. And I used it a lot. So it's nice to have it here and carry on its use. So, overall, it's not too bad. And yes, the top is from the siding. If you come over here and you look at this here, see that pattern? And pan slower this time. See that pattern? Same pattern from the siding from the shop. Adds a little heat protection, and if it doesn't work out, it's all screwed on. I could take it off and put something else up here. So, it don't matter. And also, there's one more important thing here. As to after I, as I was here finishing it, I had proper supervision. And you're wondering, okay, what's proper supervision? Let's take a walk over this way here. There's a proper supervision if I've ever seen it. Simon, the pug. Yes, he's actually looking at me with the camera today. He was in here supervising me. And of course, you know, he's on the most comfortable spot out here in the shop. So, I was properly supervised. So there you go, everybody. I know it's not much of a video. But, you know, it's nice to know that it's easy enough to make something very useful, such as that table back there behind me, out of nothing but materials and items that you've got laying around your garage or laying around your property. Like I said, I did not have to spend one dime on that. Everything that I had for it was here. The paint was the paint from the flooring. The... Uh, other paint, the spray paint, was paint that I used for another project here on the shop. So it was stuff that was left over. I wouldn't have used it for anything else. So it was nice to be able to use those things and have something that's useful. So for now, everybody, just remember, everyone's life is an adventure. Then there's mine. Cheap tables. Actually, very cheap. All but free. This is... These are the adventures of Jaws Jr. Have a good one, everybody. See ya!